Kiss goodbye to understanding this English phrase. Hello, everyone. Welcome back to our channel. Today, we're diving into an interesting English phrase. Kiss goodbye to. This phrase is quite common in everyday English, and understanding it can really enhance your language skills. So, let's get started and explore what this phrase means and how you can use it in your conversations. Kiss goodbye to is an idiomatic expression used in English. It means to accept the loss or end of something, often something you hold dear or have been hoping for. This phrase is usually used in informal contexts and conveys a sense of finality or resignation. For example, if you don't study for your exams, you can kiss goodbye to good grades. The origin of this phrase is somewhat unclear, but it's believed to stem from the gesture of kissing something as a way of showing affection or farewell. In this context, the idea is that you are metaphorically kissing something goodbye, acknowledging that you are parting with it or losing it. Let's look at some examples to see how kiss goodbye to is used in different sentences. 1. After the new regulations, we can kiss goodbye to free internet access. 2. If the team loses this match, they can kiss goodbye to their championship dreams. 3. I guess I have to kiss goodbye to my old car. It's beyond repair now. These examples show how the phrase can be applied in various situations, from casual to more serious contexts. There are several synonyms and variations of this phrase. Some of them include, say farewell to, wave goodbye to, bid adieu to. While these phrases have similar meanings, kiss goodbye to often implies a more emotional or significant loss. To remember this phrase, think of a situation where you had to let go of something important. Associating the phrase with a personal experience can help it stick in your memory. Additionally, try using it in your daily conversations or writing to become more comfortable with its usage. And that's a wrap on the phrase, kiss goodbye to. We hope this video helps you understand and use this expression confidently in your English conversations. Remember, language learning is a journey, so keep practicing and exploring. If you found this video helpful, don't forget to like, share, and subscribe for more language tips. Happy learning!